talk about something? <laughs> sure. If you're in a relationship, <coughs> don't argue in public. Public service announce announcement. Would you say that that is a... <laughs> I think that's a good idea. Makes it really, really awkward for everybody else that's around. I'm just putting that out there. Not only that, it makes you look bad. But that's the thing, I mean, we didn't you looked, do it. You looked bad in, in any way. <coughs> then you argued in public and everybody's like, waiting for someone to be like, dude, what was that? Oh, it's you're on 37 positive. degrees. 37 degrees, we're in Missouri, we Possibly just left. Possibly icy roads. Possibly icy roads, I doubt that. <coughs> but we are on our way to Oklahoma this morning, and around one o'clock, We'll be arriving in Oklahoma City. We're gonna do the memorial bombing. Bombing. The memorial. bombing memorial. There was a bomb that happened years ago in Oklahoma City. Uh, who's? Do you remember the guy's name? Nope. I forgot his name. Anyways, but I I went to the memorial with my stepmother. Uh, it was just me and her. We had a great time. Anyways, I just remember liking and thinking how cool it was. And that was before I like really liked no, stuff like this. Another sign! What in the world? I definitely want fudge from Uranus. Bridger, do you want fudge from Uranus? No! <laughs> do you think they made the sign just to be funny? make people laugh when they're driving because that was gross. <laughs> that was gross. <laughs> Were you drooling? I was drooling. Because of the Uranus fudge? Yeah, I have my mouth watering. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder what kind of flavors they got. Like turd flavor and turd pellet flavor and rabbit pellet. <laughs> rabbit pellet. <laughs> They must, they must have bear scat flavor. <laughs> Them's the ones that's got berries and stuffs in it. <laughs> berries and nuts in your fudge. <laughs> From Uranus. Oh my gosh, it's ridiculous. It's oh, funny. Oh, okay. Let's... We're on the road. <laughs> <coughs> on the road again. Any other scenic thing that we see, I'm sure we'll throw it in there too. Because, like the arches, we kind of wanted to stop yesterday, but we were trying. We're, there's not two, there's just one. Arch. I'm used to. I'm from Utah, okay? The other arches I know, arch that arches I know, National is Park. Arches National Park. <clears throat> and I've been there. Believe it or not, not been to Disneyland. Oh, did you guys know? Fun fact: Did you know Jake, myself, and our kids have never been to Disneyland? Never been to Disneyland. Never. The smarty pants keep trying to get us to go. Yeah, we have some friends too that we're going in the fall. You should come with us. It's yeah, we've never been. That'd be fun to but do on the vlog. We've never been to Disneyland. First Anyways. time for everybody. <laughs> It'd be magical. <laughs> what was that? Yes, we are. Oh, weird. What the? It's like a blanket of fog. Don't know what's on the other side. Okay, Bridge. Yeah. We're in the cloud. We're going in right now. Find home. Yeah. 
so we're right there. That's us. Yep. We're a bit we're, we're really from home, huh? We live over way over in the Well, I don't. I'm trying to find. Oh! Don't puke. Oh crap. <laughs> you need to figure it out? Yep. This Hi. is my baby sister. Hi! Hi, this is Stacy and her kids, like Haley and Ricky. He's named after my biological father. Stacy's, are you gonna puke? No. I just yes. gotta bend over because my stomach goes. Alright. <laughs> I'm like, oh, why'd she been like, over? Yeah, what a weirdo. Like, the bomb, this guy was mad at the oh, government. The yeah, and then he blew up the truck, and it blew up the building. And then so where all those chairs are, that's where the building was. And so jealous of him. He loves your hair. <laughs> You're telling him a story. He loves your hair. Yeah. <laughs> Could you do that? Just, I wore a hat. Just blew up. It's Hold because. Hold it back and wear a hat. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Thank you for visiting. Okay, so name. Okay. That's a stop hand wrap, son. No, it's not. Put your last name. Oh my gosh, are you serious, Bridger? <laughs> Okay, get in there like you want to be with some cousins. Hang out, really. That's the tree that survived. Is that what it really looked like on the side after it? They fixed it. That's where before, and then this is the 902 is where it when it happened, and then 903 is when the healing began, is the point of the pond, and so cool. And then the chairs represent the deaths that it happened, and there's little oh, tiny the ones. Yeah, there's little, see little baby chairs, it's so sad. We're at my brother's house. Say hi, Nick. Hey. And Missy. There's, it's tornado season. Did you guys know this? I'm so freaked out. Anyways, they have a shelter. Do you want to see it? I want to see it. Oh, it's not prepared, but they're going to have to get it prepared because Friday is tornado season. Here's our, here's our tap light. And you just glue it on the wall? Well, it's not got a little Velcro stick. Well, it's, you know, this is just beginning of season, so. Get, you gotta get ready. <laughs> kind of not ready right now. You have because apparently it's they're metal, gonna need to be ready by Friday. You have to have your. You gotta wear your headphones. Your ear protection. Why? Because it's really loud in here. Come in here. It echoes. Yeah, but if everybody's in here, Hello, dude, how does this fight of our life? In here? Yes, because he had brought a bowl of cereal. And <laughs> Nick brought a bowl of cereal. Well, why did you I bring was cereal? Hungry. It was time to eat. <laughs> and the spoon was like clink clink. Clink, clink. But we got migraine medicine. <laughs> they're fighting over bowl of cereal. Battery thingy. No, that's oh. the radio. Oh, this is the radio. Okay. It's emergency radio. Crank up radio. And the only reason is, hey, so something is the house falls down I on top see. of us. This that is... way we can get out. What the hell? We're we're bring, anchored into the ground. These anchors right here. Actually, there's a picture of this same. Um, storm shelter in Moore, when the big one went through Moore, uh -huh. there's nothing else around but a Ford Explorer sitting on up against one of these. And the family was inside. How'd they get it out? Well, they just opened the door and walked out. There's a Ford Explorer leaning up against it. Mm -hmm. They repainted the shelter, built a house around it, and it's there still. Yeah. But we have the TV here. Oh, this is a thick door. So we just don't know. This is do. like, you need batteries. Oh, well. Okay, how do, right. what if I... Uh, so you see the bolts here? Yeah, so you have to shut it? So it How shuts. in the hell does everybody sit in here? Well, you don't sit. You just get in there and stand. You stand for hours on end. Oh, no, no. Well, no, see, that's the deal. It means it's coming. They only shut the door twice. 
They've only shut We've it twice. We've been here four years. We've only shut it twice. And then they watch TV yeah. for the news. Yeah. Yeah. And you, who likes this season? I love it. Well, it's always fun. It's always yeah. exciting. Yeah. We usually will have the roster open and we'll watch for it. And you can see it's always exciting when you can see the tornadoes coming. What the hell? And then you see the, like, the people who are driving around. I like Utah. We don't have tornadoes. We're chasing the tornadoes. Nope, we do have well, tornadoes. We yeah. just had a tornado. Did you guys yeah. know about that? Yeah, it's just a tiny little thing. Jake, go yeah, in there. Oh, wait, I, I got to turn off the thing in there. I, there's one behind the door. I let, I, you guys just on. basically huddle together. And yeah, we just all get in there and close the door behind us. And it's got three latches, you can see. Turn off that light thing Yeah, just push behind it. the door. We usually get about five tornadoes a season. Is that about right, Nikki? About five in this area? Yeah, five probably storms that are possible tornadoes. And easy. you just kind of wait. That's awesome. Wait it out. And then the times you have shut the door, have they come? Yeah, they've been going over. But they haven't, they like, raised your house? No damage, yeah. yeah. Yeah, they hit oh. one of the and I mean, we were only in it for ten minutes. What happens? You know? What happens wow. if it hits, touching your house is destroyed? Then what? Well, then you walk out and you don't have a house anymore. But <laughs> <laughs> then the insurance picks up. <laughs> but at least you're alive. Yeah. Oh, exactly. Was it last Gosh. year that you got the YMCA? Yeah. Yeah. And Cindy was working, and so she had to get all the kids and herd them into. Which is probably about oh. a, two miles as the crow flies from here. Wow. All right, well, there so one, there was one that hit Utah and ripped the top of the Delta Center off where the Jazz play. It's no longer the Delta <laughs> Center, it's something else. <laughs> Energy Solutions Center. Right. Mm. Until right. they change the name again. Huh. Last night. Anyways, <laughs> do you guys have a tornado That's shelter? A dusty. It's yeah. crazy. No, no, you know what? This is she uses it. Oh, she uses it. Behind you. Anyways, oh, so we so live in Utah it. and I'm grateful no, for it. it. And that's bolted to the ground! Bolts, bolts are uh, supposedly 16 inches into the foundation. Wow. Each can withstand 25,000 pounds of pull. What if you don't have one? Then you just like go in your shower or what? Well, they say middle of the house, central located. A lot of people will hide in their bathtub, bathroom mm -hmm. area around the toilet. You know, when so you see a house. Most people in Oklahoma. But so some of the tornadoes, right? they'll tell you, I mean, like the F5. Is that a real you either get in this or underground, or you're not going to survive. And so a lot of people run from them, and then all the highways get blocked up, where you, there's, which is really foolish because... Then you're in a car and you're up in that Exactly. Thing. Right. I mean, the highways have gotten dreadlocked, or deadlocked. Where oh, they my move. gosh. So See, we had... That's crazy. Go ahead. Was this built in... in the house when you're... Did you have it installed? No, it was here when we bought the house. Nice. You're like... We're sold. <laughs> because, well, we, we had it at our other house before this one. We did not have a shelter. And then there was one time that they said, look, if you're not underground, oh. this is going to be bad. And it was coming. They actually named our neighborhood. Oh, man. And so we left. Well, then it turns out the storm kind of shifted south and was headed right to where we were driving. <laughs> so then we turned around and uh, we're driving back and I mean, the roads were just gridlocked instantly. I was driving my four wheel drive basically on the side of the road to get around people. Trees were flying by. Oh my God. I was hell. yelling at Missy and the kids, just get down. <clears throat> I'm doing this just for fear of, you know, I'm looking over. Taking off your... Window. Yeah. yeah, so it was pretty hairy. So that was, yeah, it was definitely after that storm and it wasn't shortly thereafter we moved. It was just that season after that because we, that was spring and then the summer we moved, but we knew that wherever we went, we were, we needed something. We were going to have something. Yeah. We weren't going to be with that. I would have to, I like Utah now. 